Are you as tired as I am of that cakey Instagram makeup look and you want something with a more natural finish that shows off your skin because you have come to the right video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you guys can go from no makeup to a natural finished skin using minimal products. I use this primer to minimize some pores and makes my skin look so much smoother. Because we won't be using foundation all over the place, you don't need to use a lot of primer when you want a flawless skin instead of using a heavy foundation you should use a tinted cream it makes your skin shine through but still covers any redness or blemishes that you may have so don't grab too much product take a little bit at a time you can always build it up if you want more product on your face so we're not going to apply the tinted cream anywhere we're only going to put it on the parts of our skin that really needs it so anywhere where you think you have a blemish or some extra redness that you'd like to cover we're going to use this so as you can see i have a bit of redness here and around my nose so i'm just going to take the sponge and i'm just going to tap the product in i want it to be smooth it must look like my own skin so we're gently just going to press that in. I like using a damp sponge. This helps me apply my makeup so much more smoothly and it doesn't absorb the product, which means there's more product for you to work with. So the next step is using a little bit of concealer. So I love using a fluffy brush when doing my concealer. So we're only gonna use the concealer on areas which still need a little bit more coverage and the fluffy brush is just gonna give you that beautiful finished airbrush look. Just a little bit over here, cause as you can see, it's a little dark under my eyes. See how just using a little bit of concealer instantly brightens up my look. If some areas are a little bit more tough than others, then you can take product directly from your concealer and use a finger and then just press on the red spots this technique won't take away from the coverage but it'll actually help your makeup melt into your skin beautiful as you can see the makeup already looks so stunning everything feels super lightweight i feel like my own skin and that's the goal that we are achieving we want to feel beautiful and confident so the next step is the powder. We are going to use this to set everything into place. As you can see, this is a loose powder. A loose fine powder is recommended because it looks finer on the skin. So we're going to tap on the powder. Um, we don't want to swipe it on because we don't want the concealer to move. We want it to stay in place and the powder is going to help with that. So what we're gonna do is we're just going to press the product in. This is an easy way to make your skin look flawless without the use of heavy foundation. 